Hi, I'm Dan Salucci, and today I'm going to show you how to carve a chicken. These techniques will guarantee that you don't waste any meat, flavor, or time. You'll be a pro before you know it. Let's get started. Before you do anything, do nothing. That's right. Right out of the oven, the chicken needs to rest at least 20 minutes before you can carve it. This allows the chicken to actually finish cooking with residual heat from the oven, in a process we call carryover cooking. The meat also reabsorbs the juices that escape the muscle fibers during cooking, leaving the juices in the meat, not on the carving board. Carving time. Using a sharp chef's knife, cut into the bird with the breast and the leg meat. Then pull the leg away from the bird and bend it back to expose the joint, and slice your knife right through it. Next, we'll separate the thigh and the drumstick. You'll find a white, thin line of fat that runs right along where the thigh and the drumstick meet. That's where you want to slice through, and your knife should go through easily. Now repeat with the other leg. Remove the wings by pulling them away from the carcass and cutting through the joint. Now repeat with the other wing. To remove the breast meat, use a sharp boning knife. Start by making a slice on one side of the breast bone. Continue slicing, following the curve of the bone, and pull the meat away as you go. So you can cut as close to the bone as possible. Of course, clean up any stray pieces as you go. Repeat this for the other side. Okay, here's a chef's tip. This right here is called the oyster. It's one of the most tender pieces of meat. Save it for yourself. Don't throw anything away. You can keep the bones and the carcass for homemade stock. Now, cut the breast meat crosswise into slices. We're going to use an electric knife for this job. It gives you power and control, and more importantly, it helps keep the skin intact. You can also use a chef's knife for this, but make sure it's a really sharp one so you don't tear the skin. And there you have it, a perfectly carved roast chicken. Thanks for watching. Tell us what you think of this how-to in the comments below and hit that subscribe button.